The Point Max I.O. platform is a remote I.O. system designed to meet the demands of today's industrial applications. It supports a wide range of I.O. types and is suitable for use in discrete, hybrid, and process environments across various industries. Hi there, I'm Hayden Ireland, and in this video, we're going to give you an overview of the Point Max I.O. platform. Point Max I.O. allows for up to 32 modules. Point Max enables fast connectivity and control with up to 1 gigabit network and backplane speeds. It can operate in environments as low as negative 13 to 140F and with XT variants to accommodate harsh environments rated to GX and G3. Point Max I.O. offers both standard safety and specialty I.O. modules that include I.O. link and heart capabilities. Compatible networking technologies include parallel redundancy protocol, device level ring, linear, and star. Point Max I.O. works with the 5380 and 5480 compact logics, as well as Control Logic's 5580 controllers, using Studio 5000 Logics Designer version 36 or later. This I.O. platform can also be added easily to a redundant 5580 Control Logic system. Over 20 years ago, Rockwell introduced the original Point I.O. platform, now one of its best-selling and most cost-effective I.O. solutions. After two decades of your feedback and insights, it's time to see how all that experience has shaped the new Point Max I.O. platform. There are major improvements in the fit, form, and finish that are evident during the assembly of Point Max components. The bus contact connection point has been dramatically improved. Instead of being located at the top of the module, it's now positioned in the same plane as the DIN rail mount, making it far more resistant to issues caused by flexing of the DIN rail or back panel. A module wiring diagram is included on the side of each of the I.O. modules. Each I.O. module shows the required removable terminal block part number. The QR code on the side of the I.O. module shows the part number, serial number, series, and the date of manufacturer. Shield clamps or wire holders can now be installed into the RTB slot to secure the cables with cable ties. Taking its cue from Flex and Flex 5000, there is a locking mechanism at the top of the module which secures the module on the right to the module on the left. The terminal bases are active, which allows for automatic slot addressing and online module additions. And of course, I.O. modules can be removed and inserted under power for standard I.O. modules. Having an active backplane also means there's no need to purchase an address reserve module for terminal bases without I.O. modules. In fact, there isn't an ARM module. There is a slot filler if you want to cover those base connectors. There's not a fill point distributor module. If you need to change the SA power bus, simply purchase the mounting base that includes the SA power feed terminal block. Point Max digital I.O. modules are available in both 8 and 16 point versions, allowing for higher density. This significantly reduces the overall width of your installation footprint. Mounting options include horizontal, vertical, or even inverted mounting orientations. Here's one of the neatest features of Point Max I.O. Using near-field communication technologies, you'll have the ability to set the IP address of the Point Max I.O. Ethernet adapter while it's still in the shipping box. You'll simply download the Rockwell application to your smartphone, and when it senses the adapter, you'll assign the IP address. The NFC mobile app will be available on either Google Play or in the Apple Store later this year. There are so many useful features that have been baked into the Point Max I.O. platform and we have only scratched the surface. Thank you for watching and if you have any questions, please contact your local ES&E account manager or automation specialist.